Lagos State Police intercept trailer from Zamfara State carrying cows, 40 men. Wonders shall never end. The Lagos State Police Command has arrested a trailer loaded with cows and about 40 men. The trailer coming into Lagos State from Zamfara State was intercepted at the beggar end of Lagos Ibadan Express Way on Monday, May 4th. Having been intercepted, the driver and his passengers were ordered to return to the state where they were coming from. The Lagos state government has placed a ban on interstate travel in an effort to curb the spread of this COVID-19 virus. Presently, only the transportation of essential goods and services is permitted between the states. As you can see, the pictures here, you see the way they packed themselves. See the way they pack themselves like the cows too. You see? I don't know the problem of these people. I don't understand their problems. Their, their state government should do something about these people. They should look for a way to let these people know about this virus. They should do more sensitization. Yes. Anyhow they want to do it, they should do it because it seems these people, they don't know what they are playing with. All these ones we are just talking about, we are just saying your own. These people, they don't understand anything about this virus. So these things we are saying, you are your own. That is the gospel truth. They should use their mosque anyhow. The imams to let these people know about the dangers of this virus. Because the way these people are going about this thing, Nigeria will spare doom. That is it. They are not, they're nothing like social distancing. They don't even obey the others. Of course, yes. Just look at what is happening in, in Kano State recently. In the first place, the governor said nothing like COVID-19. That was uh, not what was killing people there. When people, people were dying, people are, people are dying like fowls every day. The governor, the, 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 the state governor refused to accept the fact that what is killing people in, in Kano State is COVID-19 virus. It was just recently he actually accepted that what was, that is what is killing people. So you see, even their leaders, they don't believe on this virus. So how do you want these people to understand it? The day they did their Emias burial, people in Kano State were running after the cops to touch it. I shed tears that day. I was like, what is going on here? People actually want to touch the cops of Emia. You don't even know what killed him. Even at the midst, people were dying every day. People are dying every day there. People don't even want to understand that what is killing people there is COVID-19 virus. They don't care. They said they target mysterious death. Right now, Jigawa State have started their language again. Mysterious death. About 100 persons now have died in Jigawa State. Just three days now. They said it's mysterious death too. You see? As you can see, this is what we are talking about. These people are the problem of this country. They know they hear what. They know they hear what at all. What are they going to do in Lagos State with all this happening around? For goodness sake, what is wrong with them? Why can't they stay in their various states pending the time things normalize? And come to think of it, there is an interstate lockdown, yet they got to border from Zamfara State. So who is deceiving who? I don't even want to go to that side, that area. After all, they will still meet them, they themselves, those people in uniform. Those people, their own is worst. Because people are there in those borders, but they pass as far as Zamfara states. Zamfara states. They pass from there, got to Lagos there. But they said 
all the stakes are on that lockdown. So who can they deceive other? Who can they deceive each other? You see. To me, why would they return to where they are coming from? In the first place, they evaluated the law of lockdown. Yes, they did. And that they should they should be arrested, persecuted, or, or imprisoned if they can meet bay orders. Good for them. Otherwise, they all of them will be dead. And this will sound as a warning to every one of them out there. Let them hear what happened to those people. It's not only these people. Are you going to talk about those uh, Amajiris that they are sending to Enugu or the south eastern part of the country? Funny enough, most of the Amajiris in Cardinal State, most of them are even testing positive to the COVID-19 uh, COVID virus. Why are you... Oh my God, Jesus Christ. Why are these people like this? From head to toe, you cannot even select one from it. They don't listen. They don't hear word. All of them just they go muje 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 like that, like another thing. Are we going to talk about the the later lawmaker that died in Zafara State? Even when they said the state is on lockdown, these people still they work out they go barrier. Yes, I don't understand. If federal government did not do something very serious to this thing, Nigeria is going to spare them because so many persons are playing with this lockdown order. Not only them, not only the northern part, it's just that those people, their own is the worst. But even this south, 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 south is all of them. If you see what's happening on Monday, you will know that Nigeria is only God that is going to save them. Just like what I used to tell people, this time is not a matter of, I want to hear uh, what this government is saying or whatever about the lockdown or whatever. You want to uh, evaluate the law. Now it's for you to prevent your head. That is it. Anybody that is saying the virus is a scam, you are on your own. Since they are saying, now nah, lie, now nah, lie, the virus now nah, for politicians, the virus now nah, for rich people. The virus is not for poor man. Those people that are dying in Kano State, are they rich people? How many of them are rich? What of Zafara State? How many of them? You see what Nigerians are doing. This is very, very wrong. Goal. We know too well that the federal government has failed in terms of uh, providing uh, palliatives to the, to the uh, citizens. But this will not make you to run into your death trap because this virus is a death trap. If you cannot obey all these guidelines, you will enter the trap and it's, that is where you will meet your death. People don't want to listen. People don't want to hear what. If you go to the banks, if you see how people are packing themselves there, nothing like social distancing, even the banks, they are not even doing anything about these things they're not even coordinating their customers they just left everywhere porous are we talking about markets immediately the open market it was like wow uh, it, it, it just be like chicken when all these are greek chicken when they cage things they just let them out see that they walk out zubi 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 the language you know the slug i beg i won't go also make government not go use hunger kimi but they have forgotten that Health is weight. If you are not healthy, you, are, you cannot hustle. That is the truth. I'm not saying people should not go, go out to go and hustle at least to get what they can eat. But let, let them obey all these guidelines. Let them be restrictions to all these things. Listen to what NCDC is talking about. Because this virus, you don't know anybody for face. If he won't catch you, he go gum you and he go kill you now, so he be. Funny enough, the way these things are killing people in Nigeria, it's just like, once you just say, hey, malaria, pick, the person don't die. That is the reason why the uh, Kano State uh, said what, uh, what, what killed those people then was uh, malaria and uh, hypertension and all that. After all, ego must bring sickness when go kill you. 
Nigerians learn sense. So hello guys, I'm going to drop it here. Kindly leave your opinion below the comment box. Thank you.